Need to see your brother do what he did the other day. Oh man, I can't even like describe it. It almost felt like I caught the peak. Like I was <laughs> trying to be the first one over there to just get hype with him. It was just, I don't know, I just can't even explain it. It was just, just I don't know, it was just fun to see. Just I was just happy. I was just so happy for him. What is it? I mean, is it what does it mean to be on the it's kind of a similar question, to be on the field together? Um considering I mean that's not something that's pretty common. Yeah, just bliss. Me and him talked about it in high school. From when we was on the field together in high school, we always like playing to like be on the field together in college and in the NFL. And it was just, I don't know, just almost like surreal, just looking to the side of me and just seeing my younger brother out there. As a true freshman, that, that was just, I, don't know, I just really can't even explain that either. What was your view of it? Where were you? Uh, I was on the right side and he was to the field then when he caught the pick. So it was kind of on different sides, but like I could still kind of just pick over and see, see him. What's that show about back-to-back -back weeks, you know, young guys coming in and, and you're getting a pick? Last week it was Cam, this week it was uh, Dylan. I mean, what does that show about just the depth you all have at uh, DB? Uh, it really shows a lot. You know, we still preach, uh, you know, next man up, you never know when it's your turn. And the way we practice, the, the twos practice like one. So we just kind of just carry that mentality going into the game. How much were you involved in run support last week? And with another run team coming up, West Virginia wants to run the football, you know, you like that, or would you rather have guys dropping back and you know defending the pass every down? Uh, it really don't matter to me. At corner, we kind of uh, you know preach in the meeting room to be physical, uh, and we just try to carry that into every game. That no matter what game it is, we just got to be physical, regardless if it's a run or a pass. Maybe rain. I just saw the forecast. I hate that. I don't like to get wet. Mm -hmm. uh, what what about you know? Obviously, I would think in the rain. It helps you guys. It's slick ball. It's harder for them to, to, to get it done. Yeah, we kind of just try not to focus on, you know, the weather too much, you know, focus on things that we can control. So even if it's raining, we still just going to go out there and just do our job. It rained against them last season. Yeah, yeah it did. A lot. Yeah, yeah, that was a miserable day. It was, but, you know, we just kind of focus on the ball might be sleek. They might run the ball a lot. We just focus on, you know, making tackles. If the ball's in the air, you know, just gonna go make a play on the ball. Teams aren't throwing at you corners much this year. Is it? Does that take a little bit more – um, mental toughness to kind of stay locked in as much whenever you're not getting balls thrown to you as much? Uh, I wouldn't say it takes as much. You know, we kind of, even though they're not really throwing the ball at us as much, we still kind of just try to, you know, say focus on they could throw it this way. Or if they're not throwing it, uh, get off the block, go make a tackle. That's kind of what we just try to focus on, stay locked into that. Teams really haven't thrown at Corey that much. Is that kind of a sense of pride as a corner whenever guys aren't even looking your way? Uh, I mean, you, you could probably say that. We kind of get a little bit like, Dang, why they not throwing it at us? Like, like we want we want the ball thrown at us so that we can show everybody that we can make plays too. And these last couple of weeks, man, defense has really been creating turnovers. Is there a common theme behind those turnovers? Uh, just effort, playing hard. We always talk about we got to go change the game. We got to kind of just trying to have that mentality that we got to go be the difference makers, and that's just kind of what we preach on the uh, sideline. Come on, it's us. We got to go get a turnover. Has DJ surprised you at all this season? It seems like from the outside, he's played more than maybe you'd expect a Richard Brown. Yeah. No, he ain't surprised me at all. I've been seeing him do this since the spring, the fall. It was just only a matter of time before he got on the field, you know, starting to prove what he actually can do. Kim, this